sawmill. Uh, just a uh, just a quick update uh, on what I've done uh, past couple of days, and uh, I'm not going to do a sawing video today. Uh, it's getting later in the afternoon. Uh, the sun's going down. Of course, it's dark, dark in here. Uh, really say in here because I'll show you uh, kind of what I've done for the mill, uh, and uh, show you some uh, future things that I've got going. So. Just hold on and uh, we'll uh, we'll get started. All right, guys. So what we've we done, uh, of course, that's the lumber I had. You know, you've seen that last video. Uh, got rid of a lot of that over there. Uh, got rid of some of this poplar. This is them oak uh, oak boards that we cut in the last video. Some pretty green and things. I still haven't edged that one off yet, but uh, but anyway but uh uh got some slabs here i had to cut earlier uh i made a little uh i just made just a little bunk throw some stickers in uh, i've got to make a block more i've got more than that i just haven't got them in there yet and uh and that's just the poplar and oak uh, laps that i'd cut off for firewood that i'll use myself uh, but yeah i'll show you uh show you guys what I've been uh, working on and there you can see I've got part of the building up um, and of course I am going to come on out all the way across the mill with the roof uh, of course I'm going to leave the front of it opened uh, the back I'll probably uh, I'll probably box in about four foot down and leave the bottom of it open so I can get around there to get the sawdust out and I'm going to move all that all that lumber of course to be stacked on out but the mill uh i got this part done um out of all the lumber some of the lumber that i have cut i uh, cut all of it myself on this mill but uh, at least i got the at least i can get the head of the mill inside the building now so out of the weather i don't have to cover it up but uh i'm going to do a uh it'd be a board and batten uh i haven't done the batten strips yet but uh but yeah it'll uh it'll do good and i just put metal uh for the roof but uh <clears throat> i think it's going to work out real good um it's not real big it's only uh it's only 10 by 10 foot by 10 foot uh i did throw in a couple extra put a couple shelves back here uh you know just to keep some junk on they'll fill up in time i know uh i got some old old blades hanging over there i got my new ones in the other building but uh I'll tell you what, though, guys. This Range Road, this is a this is a great mill. Uh, I've used it now for almost three weeks. I have absolutely no problem with it at all. Um, other than, uh, of course, I didn't like I said, I didn't went through two blades, cutting cutting some stuff. But uh, if you're looking in for a mill, you know, on a on a good budget, this is the way to go. This is a this is a great mill. Uh, Fifteen horse engine. This is a twenty six inch mill does does really well and it's got uh, of course i did you know i told you i got the extensions so i can cut uh, a little over 17 feet almost 17 foot three inches on this mill uh i do i do need to get do need to get one more uh, log clamp i do want one more log clamp for it uh i do have an i do have two extra bunks uh, if i ever need them um But I've got them if I need them. Uh, my camera cut off there. Sorry about that. But yeah, that's what I've been working on. Just putting the building up over the mill. Uh, like I say, I'm going to do a board and batten. Uh, about over this is pine. Uh, got a couple of poplar boards in there. But uh, but I think it'll it'll serve a purpose for what I'm using it for. It's not going to be a permanent spot. But it'll last you know a year or two. Uh, kind of put that uh, slab board up there. I just thought it looked pretty cool gave it some character but uh yeah like i say i have to put the batten strips on uh can't really get around the back i've got some logs piled up here but uh that's a pretty cool board going down the side i just put it on there for some detail got fire going trying to burn up some of this some of this junk here but but yeah oh about fell but that's what i've been up to 
and uh, I was going to get into doing a video on the slabs I cut. I didn't really have time to video it, but I am going to cut more. Uh, I've cut three of them walnut logs. I've got some more to cut there, and uh, still got those up on the bank. I got to get down. I got to go pick up pick up some more walnut next week uh, <clears throat> for a customer. So anyway, just thought I'd do a quick quick update uh on the sawmill shed yeah uh, if you will but yeah so be sure to hit that like subscribe notification uh help the channel uh we'll get it going and then we'll get uh we'll get the top on the rest of the mill <coughs> excuse me get all that cleaned up just that's just kind of a scattered mess right now but uh that's the way it is so anyway, appreciate you guys. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, having comments, leave them. Like reading all the comments. And uh, we'll catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching.